Hey there. Guess what? I'm level 80. We've finally done it. Not that it's something I've been really working towards for anything in particular, but we are... Wait, am I level 80 or can I just... No, I can reach level 80. Um... Now I'm level 80, which means I can hop down here and grab this red supply drop. The first red supply drop of this series. And hopefully it's a goodie. Hopefully it's a good one. Hopefully this is the start of great supply drops to come because we all know uh, supply drops aren't really your best friend. They're meant to be. They're meant to reward you with goodies. But um, in Ark, well, I, I, I don't know. You get, you get a basilisk saddle apparently this time around and a baryonic i don't know i'm gonna hold on to them just in case but still guys welcome back welcome back to our omega series where things are going good i'm feeling good i'm feeling happy i think we're uh, doing a fantastic job this series especially compared to the last time i played this mod where um it was just a disaster um however have a look at this thing i was saw the red little glow bug and i was like what's his story here's an omega knockback i kind of want to get knocked back by it just to see what happens an omega oh my goodness um there are some crazy guys down here uh, a few omegas beta fire raptor regular diplodocus i'm not gonna mess with any of them um however i do really 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 want to finally tame some dinosaurs not that we haven't been doing that we've tamed a lot it may not look like it. We literally have a Tyranodon and a Dodo to our name. Um, but we have tamed a lot. They're just all living inside of my little egg collector over here. I really, though, want to set out to tame some, like, utility dinosaurs. Dinosaurs that we're not just going to stick in our little machine over there. And we're actually going to use. And the, I guess the best part about all of this is, aside from our very over... We got a lot of eggs. Okay, just ignore that. We're going to have to... I'm going to turn down egg rates. It's nuts. It's a little bit out of control, I'll be honest with you. Uh, <laughs> I'm used to playing single player. We're playing in a server now, which means 24-7 eggs are just generating. It's getting crazy. Um, but I can basically tame or craft. Tame? We can tame. We can tame alpha dinosaurs now, which is pretty sweet. Um, we can't get many. We can get guardians, nightmares, or resource ones. Um, but, you know, with a little bit of work, we can make the other stuff happen as well. Um, but I think it would just be cool to get ourselves like a Rex or a Kano. I know I'm just being very generic with those examples. But just something cool and strong that I can actually just go around and annihilate dinosaurs with. Because as it stands, I don't know, our Rampage Tyranodon and his 1500 damage isn't really cutting it. Another one. Prime Rampage Glowbug. I wonder if I can, I mean, I doubt it's going to, I doubt you can aggro one of those, but that would be it's such a handy tame. I, I, there's no way I'm going to hit this thing with a net in like ever if my life depended on it. Um, there's also a beta collective glow bug over there. I'll just pretend they don't exist because they looks like they're just going to reach the, the world limit and disappear into obscurity. Um, but I've been looking at what we're kind of working on currently, where we're going to go next. And it seems like one of the big things in this mod is uh, something to do with, and let me just pop this open so I know what I'm talking about here. Uh, scroll down a little bit. Omega Sorting Network. So supposedly there's a pretty cool sorting storage network that you can use with this mod. Um, it involves a bunch of stuff. Uh, dimensional storages, void vacuums, grinders, dumpsters, quantum compactors. I'm going to start working on this. There's also set mannequins, unique totems, um, soul compressor. There's a bunch of stuff here. i got some learning to do. I feel like I'm going to focus on this off camera. I'm going to try and build something up and I'm going to share it with you guys once it's done. Um, just because I don't know what I'm doing and I feel like it's best that I just do it and then I show you later. Um, but hey, like we can craft a lot of this stuff like the void vacuum, the chromatic can I can't craft that just yet. Soul grinder. I don't have ultimate essence for that. Soul furnace. Also don't have them for that. Soul magnets. We need a lot of prime essence. The red dwarf. We do actually want to get a red dwarf so I can build up a farm. We don't have that yet either. The Omega item fragmenter. This is actually something I really want to get my hands on. But as you can see, we need a bunch of ultimate essence to make that happen. Not a lot, but we do need a bunch of them. Who knows? Maybe we'll kind of be able to find some today. Uh, this one here, though, gets me excited. And that is because uh, you can break down a lot of the random bits of resources that we're finding so i think that's pretty cool and then there's this but i need oh man i need some thatch for that unfortunately um item mannequins a set item mannequins that would be cool to put out sets of armor on we've got a lot of them um if we don't break them down but the void vacuum is i'm just gonna place it here for the time being is this it's space 
Um, I remember this being added last time I played the mod, except it was very different. From what I understand, though, um, dropped item pickup, automatic item transfers, uh, dino inventory, withdrawal on attack. There's a lot of different settings, and I'm going to have to look into these. But I, from what I gather, if I were to, like, drop items... I guess it... Man, that was quick. What sort of range does this thing have? Sh uh, show range. That helps. Um, okay. Okay. <laughs> so if I drop anything in my base, it's going to get sucked into this. That's kind of cool. Um, share settings. Oh, I don't really know. But I don't know if there's like a... Whoa. Hello. That's kind of trippy. Dude, it's like a black hole. Um, is that something I just did? I have no clue. We. Oh, that is so weird. I'm inside of it. Oh, that is like... That is so... <laughs> oh, it's like distorting space time. I feel like I'm in interstellar. Anyways, you get the idea. It's pretty cool. Um, but I believe what we will be able to do eventually is access our items from around the map. Um, I think there is some sort of remote that allows us to do that. Or maybe like a controller? Warp. I don't know. There, there is something we can do to access this. And what I was thinking was we can basically store our kibble in there. Maybe I can craft up a bunch right this second. Let's see what we can actually do here. Um, in fact, I'm just going to go like something silly like this. Oh, we're going to use up so many resources to do this. I need more beta essence. Um, I guess I can like grab all of these souls. This is what I need, right? Beta essence. Man, I'm going to waste so much stuff right now. Um, but I'm hoping basically what we could do is access our kibble remotely while we're out and about and doing our thing um that's yeah i don't know kind of the idea that i'm thinking of what eggs are we missing here oh it's the eggs it's not this eh it doesn't matter whatever um anyways let's get some beta kibble going that way i can come back and grab it when we need it or maybe we just go looking for dinosaurs and we're like worry about it then let's just go looking out and see what we can find <laughs> <laughs> we're taking it one step at a time so this place over here has been a pretty 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 sweet spot for, for crazy dinosaurs uh unfortunately mostly oh should i just get that kill real quick oh hello well, hold on what are you beta summoner i think i excuse me i didn't think the feather light was gonna do that to me that's that's not cool at all dude that's not cool at all what do you what do you think this is i dare you to do it again also, why am I moving so quick? I feel like I've I've been like accelerated all of a sudden. Um, where did that dodo go though? Wait, what just happened? Did it oh over here? I think I just kind of ended up somewhere I didn't think I was. Uh beta clone a dodo. I think I would actually benefit from taming that. There's also a beta spiritual compi. Yeah, I need these. Oh, 100 percent I need these. Um, okay. Compi, you're the little speedy dude. Come here. Get netted, dodo. Uh, you're also getting netted, my friend. And then I'm not even going to... Wait, I just need my club. Plonk. Oh, I'm going to have to hit you a bunch of times. Ugh. Oh, no. Hi. Phoenix, Sarko. Oh, my goodness. Go. Okay. This isn't... This isn't... Ah, this isn't what was meant to be going on. I should have just got the this little dude first. Um, How do I get rid of this guy now? Who's actually trying to attack me now? I don't even know. You, uh, no, I need this compi. I want this compi. Let me just... Can I pick the compi up? Don't, don't attack it, you banana. I'll just bring this up to base and we can tame it up there. I don't think he's going to run from me. This should be a pretty simple tame. I should have just done the same with the dodo, as a matter of fact. I should just do this with everything from now on. Okay. Get netted. Or not. Get netted. Got you that time. Oh, okay. You're going to do that, are you? Well, go to sleep. There you go, all right? Beta spiritual compi has been... Can you not... My little vampire dodo trying to kill the poor thing. My goodness. Now let's go and do the exact same with this dodo. I wasn't... Hey. Oi. Sorry, dodo. Come with me and my little dude. I'll save you. I'll protect you. And then I'll grind you into a little meaty pulp and put you inside of my, my egg machine. It's kind of so brutal when you put it that way. But I don't know. It's the unfortunate reality of the situation. Now... Time for you to go to sleep. I'm not going to waste any arrows on you because you're not worth it. But easy. Easy knockout. There we go. Don't clone me, please. You totally just cloned one of my dinosaurs, didn't you? You cloned the compi. <laughs> um, and the dodo. No. 
Uh, we got clues in the base. All right, you guys just stay chill. Just stay chill. Don't attack nothing. We're not aggressive. Okay, they despawned. Lovely. So I need some beta ethereal and I need some beta summoner kibble. Let's get that straight away. Um, it's the it's the stuff I didn't just craft, I'm pretty sure. But we're going to need two of these. I've already got one. Oh, uh, hello. Okay, cool. So that is our second. We've got two beta ethereal and then two beta summoner. And just like that, we now have access. Well, once they lay me some eggs, of course, we got access to two completely new variants. That's the wrong one, right? No, that was the right one. Wait, you only wanted one. Oh, you only wanted one kibble? Um, but we now have access to alpha uh, summoner dinosaurs and alpha ethereal dinosaurs. So that's great. Uh, I feel like you're going to take a little longer. You are taking your sweet old time to get hungry. All right, fine. Well, you can just sit and chill for the time being. I'm going to go and stick this poor compy inside of my machine over here. Poor thing. But that's all just what happens. And we're going to get some more beta eggs, which means we're going to eventually get some more alpha kibble. Well, while my little dodo up here is doing his thing, let's head back out of here. Because just over here... Oh, man, a beta spiritual... Dude, that would actually be handy. It's not what I came over here looking for, but spiritual dinosaurs are really fast. And we do, like, hold on, I'm not looking at the... That's a treasure compy. Hold on. I'm trying to avoid... I'm trying to avoid that. Ultimate Colossus Sarko. <laughs> that thing would absolutely annihilate me. Um, but we got a little treasure compy here. I need this. I'm bringing this to base. I'm going to kill this. And see what sort of treasure it gives me. Because as we have found, treasure dinosaurs, pretty darn sweet. Oh, but you can't do that. You can't net them. Okay. Um, what am I? Hold on. Whip, whip, whip. My whip. My whip's amazing. Uh, not against these, apparently, though. All right. We'll just fight it like this, then. Just like this. A little bit unorthodox, but it is what it is. And he's probably going to give me bugger roll, but he's going to give me some treasure. So that's nice, at least. A lucky soul. Basic essence. Is that it? I don't think he gave me any treasure. Wait, wasn't that it? That was a treasure dialogue, or am I imagining this? I already had all of this in my inventory, or is this... Maybe this is all new. I don't know. I'm losing the plot. What can I say? Let's get back to business for the third time now, and I'm not going to look at any other dinosaurs. I wanted to come over here and look at what I thought was an Allosaurus. We've got a few of them over here. We also got Spiritual Sabertooth, an Omega Vampire Ravager, Beta Siren Sabertooth, an alpha fire. I can't tame that. Uh, a knockback Allosaurus. Urgh. Stone rubble golem. Like as much as I was kind of like, oh, I was hoping for these Allosauruses to be tameable, but they're not for me right this second. We do have uh, some other stuff over here though. Clone Mantis, Psychosis Raptor. We got a vampire scorpion, Meltdown Raptor. And what's that one in the distance? Or is it this one I've missed? I think there's actually two Meltdown Raptors. We got some more Allosauruses over here, though. We've got a Beta Vampire. That thing would actually be tough. Pride. There's a unique Sabertooth down there? Interesting. Oh, it's a variant? It's a Paragon and a Controller. In okay, that's, that's cool. It looks like it's got two... I didn't even know that that could happen. So there's unique variants that have double abilities. And I'm trying to like get, I don't know which one it is. It'll be the one that looks like a Paragon Dinosaur. I'm also not trying to get too close because I don't know what these guys are going to do to me. And I don't really want to aggro them. Um, but I'm interested in this Beta Vampire Allosaurus. I, I can tame it very easily. I just need to do 85,000 Torpor. Um, the interesting thing about it though is... Well, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's strong. It, it would by far be our strongest dude that we've got. Or do I focus on this unique pride saber-tooth tiger who is trying to see what sort of damage he's dealing. He's, he's, he's hitting pretty hard, I think. I want to get down there and like deal with it, but it's probably not going to go well for me. Maybe I'll just sit around and like reap the benefits of whoever ends up dying in all of this mess here. I probably shouldn't be down here. This is going to end up so darn bad, but... Uh, let me just health potion myself. Rampage mode it. And I'll, I'll help him out. I'll help him out. Give me that experience. I'm going to die. Oh, my goodness. I don't actually know what hurt me just then, but... 
I nearly died. <laughs> that, that could go on really badly. I want to get this saber tooth. All right. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I mean, maybe the answer isn't taming up an Allosaurus because clearly I can kick this thing's butt. And there's be a bit of a downgrade, I guess. Uh, interesting. Well, maybe I'll keep my Tyranodon for a little bit longer then. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. Come on. Like one more hit. I swear if I, I didn't get that kill, did I? Oh, no, I did. Okay, good. I thought someone was going to steal it. Now, what happened to that Sabertooth Tiger? Where did he go? There he is. There he is. So he's got 6,000 health. I... I, I want to know about it. I want to know what it's what its deal is. Maybe it's tameable, but it's it's only got 6,000 health. Controller and Paragon, but it's a unique. Why does that just sound so enticing? Also, I keep forgetting to equip. Can I fight you? Now these guys are really strong. Oh, and he's got me with this all effect. Maybe I'll just let this guy go. I don't think I've got what it takes to get a little pride saber tooth i don't even know what's damaging me right this second but i didn't have control of my there we go whoa he nearly killed me i i didn't have control i, I couldn't see actually how much health my dude here had um so good thing good thing good thing good thing it's still alive yeah i'm not gonna mess with the saber okay unique saber seems kind of crazy and tough no thank you very much ho, 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 ho. explosive fenra i didn't even know that they exist but that is really cool. Hmm. I think I found two guys that might actually be a pretty good inclusion to the squad. I'm just going to be a little careful there because there are some strong Omegas and stuff in the area. Um, but this one here for a start, a Water Storm Calicotherium. Who is attacking me? A Beta Collective Argentavis. Rampage. Rampage mode. Let's go. You wanted this? Come and get it. Um, but oh wait, do I need you? I don't think I need a beta guardian, but you're doing your little collection thing, which means I can't damage you. And that's super annoying. So just, I'll be right back. There you go. Nice little bomb you set off. But now I got to come and finish the job. All right. Don't with the Archie, but this guy right here, the elemental tier is the last thing that we need. Um, so I'm thinking it might be time for, wait, no, that's an alpha. I could also tame this though. I might need to consider that. You're not what I thought you were. That is what I wanted to go and get. Um, I don't actually need to do much to it, but the problem is if I attack this, is it gonna go and aggro that one? I think it's just a risk I'm gonna have to be willing to take. Um, this guy's gonna get so angry with me in a second, but it is what it is. Got you down. Are we good? Are we good? All right, sweet. His mate's okay. Nobody else is angry. Fantastic. Now, what else have we got? We got a Prime Pearl Kairuku. We also got some pretty spooky music. <laughs> so I'm just going to ignore that. An Omega Controller Kairuku. Um, what's this one here? A Omega. There's so many Omegas down here. Like everything in this is an Omega Dinosaur. Um, but yeah, this guy here. Elemental Kibble. Oh, get out of town. What are you doing? What are you doing? Please stop. Um, I guess I'm going to have to whip this thing. That's not going to do much though, is it? No, I killed what I needed. Oh my goodness. What are you doing? Oh, where did that even come from? Somebody get angry and spawn in a wyvern. Ah, oh, that was meant to be my elemental dream. It's a minion. I don't know who brought this thing to the party, but no, go away, go away. But that is, ah, the water Argentavis ain't going to help us either. Ah, oh, that actually hurts. Dang it. Back to the dream of finding an elemental dinosaur. Ooh, this could be a nice little farm over here. They are just little Kairukus, but each one of these guys has something going for it. Um, I am surely could find something interesting in this mix. We're mostly looking for alphas and betas. Um... A beta spectral, I don't need that. A volatile, no. A siren, no. Beta astral, no. Knockback, no. Man, maybe I just fill my squad with <laughs> with penguins. Um, except none of these guys are like what I'm looking for. A beta starfire, though. That, that is interesting. I just need to be very careful and make sure that this thing doesn't drop a bomb on my face. Oh gosh, this isn't working out. Can I just club you? 
All right, he set me on fire. He set me on fire. Okay, I am on fire. I repeat, I am on fire. Run to the water. It's not going to really do me much, though. Um, the fire doesn't seem to be hurting me a whole lot, though, so that's nice. Okay, for reals, though, get wrecked. <laughs> get absolutely wrecked. All right, that's great. I do need this thing here, so fantastic. Add him to the squad. Um, we got ourselves Omega Vampire. Nope. Siren Kairu Ku. Nope. Alpha Lightning. If I sort out the other ele elementals that I'm looking for, then maybe there is an Alpha Stalker over here. Beta Plague, but it's a male. Dang it. Uh, a Prime Comet. Not quite. Alpha Phoenix. Like, could be handy soon, but not right this second. Beta Water. No. Beta Blizzards. No. Banshee. Nope. Alpha Random. Nope. Dang. Like, all of you guys are just not what I need. Well, in good news, we have this little guy teamed up, so at least I can go and throw him inside of my egg machine. And while we're here, we're obviously going to go and grab myself. Uh, I need, to, I need a, a, a cosmic beta kibble. We've already got one crafted. Lovely. Fantastic. But you see, it's not all bad. In fact, is there any bad? Because so far, it's actually all pretty good news. Um, this guy here is actually going to help us amazingly. And the reason for that is because all of these variants and stuff that we're taming up, none, they're not all created equally. Um, long story short, though, cosmic and rage tiers are actually, I guess they're, they're more powerful. They're stronger than the others, I guess. And that kind of is gone over in here in that little variance section. Um, I actually don't know where it's mentioned. Um, but here, for example, as you can see, the rage class stat multiplier is 6x. And that also goes for cosmic. And it goes for a few others. Nature is another one. I don't know which other ones, but oh, there we go. Unstable is another, but as you can see, some are just 1x, uh, some are 4x. I think elemental is pretty... Oh, 4x. Wow. Elementals actually go pretty hard then. Um, but they all come with different, I guess, different different stat multipliers and stuff like that. So, yeah, having ourselves a beta cosmic is going to allow us to obviously get an alpha cosmic. And cosmic are some of the strongest, I guess, variants in the game. So, we're getting pretty close, I think, to finding a, 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 a dinosaur or a variant that we can actually go and kick some serious butt with. Red drop. Don't let me down. A tap and Jarrah saddle. Not bad. Not bad at all. Now, let's see what we can find in the rest of these guys. Ooh. An alpha vampire. That is a female. I... Pretty sure I can get that. I can. 43,000 torpor, though. I could one-shot it. I'm going to one-shot it. Hello, friend. You are going to be my first... Hold on. There we go. You're going to be my first alpha team. Thank you very much. <laughs> what else can I find here? Um, pygmy. Nope. Brutal. Not right this second. Omega Psychosis. No thanks. Alpha Cloner. Not really going to do us too much good. Alpha Siren. I need a beta siren first though. Dimensional. I could fly around on a Kairuku if I wanted. Um, a lot of these are ultimates. I'm just not ready for them. Made a frenzy. Man, if you were a female, you would be perfect. Okay. Don't mind. I'm not going to mess with you. Prime Overlords. <laughs> Omega Firestorm. Probably not. Ooh. An Alpha Stone Kairuku. That would actually be really good. Also, look at these guys just chilling over here. Um, Found another one. I need you. Sit still. Wait, I got to go in. It's like that. And pink. Have a nice nap. Dang, I gotta find a way to get myself up here now. I'm totally gonna end up falling in the water. No! Now I gotta go and swim back to my Teratodon. Oh my goodness. Hmm. Maybe I'll just swim underneath the iceberg. I don't think I've ever done this, but that worked out really handy. There we go. Now, the last little section that I wanted to check out. I knew that there was something. I know. D yes. 100% yes. Uh, oh, I gotta pick, select the arrow again. Okay, go to sleep. Oh, you're kidding. I just wasted an arrow on you. All right, you're going. I killed it. No. Oh, you're kidding me. I really needed that. That would have been amazing. They're one of the harder ones to find, but I guess it just wasn't meant to be. Um, we, okay, an elemental, an elemental at last. 
Uh, yes, yes, I need you. I need you. Just a regular old little beta arrow. I should have done it in the head. I was worried about killing it. Fine. Take a few more. No water storms on me, my little dude. Not today. I could have sworn there was something else up here that I needed to tame. And now I can't remember what it was. How unfortunate. And then that sudden realization creeps in. I can't craft alpha kibble. I need long grass. You know, the vegetable that you need to farm. I need that one. I need it for all of them. Every single one of these. I don't have it though. And then for prime, I need... It also, it's, I need a lot of long grass. Ah. Oh. So after all of that, I've got three penguins schnoozing over there. And I can only tame one of them. I guess it's time I set up a farm. <laughs> We've got no choice. That actually stings so badly. I, I do have the foundations ready to go, I suppose. But still. Oh, that actually stings. Oh, that hurts. Oh, what do you do? It's not all doom and gloom, though. We do get to bring home this little guy. Ticking the final boss of all of the basic tiers. Which was the... Uh, the elemental so we've got ourselves an elemental variant now um i guess the next step for us is to build a farm come here my little friends over this way over this way it's time for you to get ground up with the rest of our little buddies here unfortunately integrate them into my machine and uh just like that we're good well yeah we're good they're not but hey Sometimes sacrifices need to be made. I'm going to build a farm. I'm going to get these long grass. I'm going to get these alpha kibble. Hopefully in time for our Kairuku to be tamed up. I'm not holding my breath though. And neither should they. Uh, vegetables can take some time to grow. So fingers crossed that we get this stuff ready in time. But thanks for watching guys. Tomorrow alphas for sure. I think. Maybe. Fingers crossed. You'll have to wait and see. But until then keep smiling. Have a fantastic day. Bye for now.